Come to the theme of today's evening is India 2030. We are in 2024. Six years from now, if you're engaging in a similar conversation, a similar forum, what are the three big marquee changes which the regulator feels will happen in the Indian financial sector? You see, six years from now, I'll be sitting somewhere there. <laughs> so, <laughs> but uh, on a more uh, serious note, we have laid down the agenda for RBI at 100, which is a part of our, uh, you know, the monetary policy statement, which we made, you know, when we celebrated our uh, uh, RBI, you know, the 100th year of Reserve Bank uh, on 1st of April, where the Prime Minister also, uh, you know, he addressed the entire uh, gathering. After that, we have worked and we have come out with this agenda for RBI at 100. Reserve Bank as an institution needs to be future ready. And uh, we have spelt out several steps, I think about nine or ten different areas where we have spelt out what kind of steps. This is not a, you know, this is a dynamic document. It cannot be a static document because the world is changing and changing fast. So you cannot just decide your action plan for 10 years and just stick to that. You have to constantly update it and modify that. And modify meaning upgrade that from uh, time to time. Supplement that as may be necessary. But yes, we would like uh, Reserve Bank, as we have said in that document, we would like Reserve Bank to be a model central bank, especially for the global south. We would like Reserve Bank as a central bank which has consistently maintained financial stability and has ensured a uh, if, uh, and has ensured a conducive ecosystem for the overall economy to grow.